to install OpenSSL, let's check uh, in command prompt cmd, command prompt type OpenSSL, it's not there. And then uh, go to this website. I'll have the link in the description. And then uh, scroll down and you'll see an installer for 64-bit or 32-bit and also a smaller 3MB version and a larger 63MB version. I would just go with this uh, smaller version. And uh, to check your system type, you could go to system, system information, and then it is here, system type 64 or 32. And uh, once you have started the installer after downloading, your screens would be for 32 or 64. Click next, and then uh, accept the default installation directory. Click next again, and then again the default Windows directory next. And then either you could choose to donate or not here and then click finish and uh, so that's one way of uh, installing OpenSSL and before actually doing that uh, and if you have installed git uh, you should have uh, OpenSSL already so uh, you could go to your program files or you could even just search for OpenSSL here in your Windows Explorer uh, program files git user bin and scroll down okay this here open SSL so just copy the path from here I mean here copy that and then so either way, if you are installed uh, from the download or if you already have the uh, OpenSSL in your Git folder, uh, just go ahead and then set the environment path. So env, edit the system environment, click that, environment variables, go to system variables and then path, click edit and then click new, paste the path here, click OK, and then again, OK, OK, and then bring up your um, command prompt, actually close that, and then bring type CMD command prompt, and then type open as a cell. So now it is installed and you're all set. You could just type exit. That's it. Thank you.